This is the 25th anniversary of the ceremony. The annual event attracts thousands to Magic Island. But as Paul Drews reports, if one veteran gets his way, this could be the last year of the Lantern Floating Festival on Memorial Day. Memorial Day is a time to honor U.S. military personnel who died while serving in the United States Armed Forces. That sacrifice honored at the National Cemetery of the Pacific at Punchbowl at the 73rd Mayor's Memorial Day Ceremony. You know, President Franklin Delano Roosevelt once wrote that we have learned in the agony of war that great power involves great responsibility. The sacrifice and sense of duty that Memorial Day represents should serve as a beacon of that responsibility, guiding us toward a world that is worthy of the heroes that we honor today. Military honors and wreaths laid in recognition of Hawaii's servicemen and women, along with stories of sacrifice. Every one of the stories of sacrifice in the punch bowl is different but all of them have one thing in common. Every individual buried here, over 60,000 people, dedicated their lives to a cause greater than themselves. That cause is our freedom. But along with ceremonies at Hawaii's veteran cemeteries, there's another big event on Memorial Day, the Shinyuin Lantern Floating Festival, which recognizes not only veterans who died, but everyone who has passed. It's a federal holiday to honor our fallen. And when you honor everybody else, that's not honoring our fallen. Well, in Pete Dingstrom is a retired Special Forces soldier that now has a new mission, move the Lantern Floating Festival from Memorial Day. I think this beautiful ceremony needs to be over Memorial Day weekend, but not on Memorial Day. He says he's a fan and supporter of the Lantern Floating Festival but also adds his efforts to have Shinyuin move the event to a different day have not been successful. So he now plans to file a permit to hold a military event on Memorial Day in 2025 at Magic Island, which would force the Lantern Floating Festival to change its day. 2025, this is what we're hoping for. Saturday, the beautiful Floating Lantern Festival, like they do every year, just on Saturday instead of on Monday. There's people that sacrifice their life that are no longer with us to give us these freedoms to go have go to the beach. We're only asking for one day out of the year and a couple hours out of somebody's time to pay those respects. Paul Drews, Island News.